Croatia will not be disqualified from the World Cup, despite calls to have them removed from the final. England were eliminated from the competition after bowing out in the semi-finals to the Balkan nation on Wednesday night. Mario Mandzukic's goal in extra time condemned England to their fate and sent Croatia into their first-ever showpiece match, where they will face France. However, since the semi-final, there has been continual calls for Croatia to be thrown out of the competition. In fact, World Cup Croatia disqualified has become one of the most searched for terms in Google from users in the United Kingdom since the end of the game. Mansukic scored the goal which sent England out of the World Cup, image, AFP, England crashed out of the World Cup at the semi-final stage, image, AMA, Getty, we linked up with our friends at Football, London to list the reasons why people want to see Croatia kicked out of the final, and also explain why it will not happen. Rebic shown two yellows but not a red. The theory, there was some confusion when Antti Rebic was booked in the first half of extra time as many were led to believe he had already been cautioned in the 48th minute. It had looked on the TV like Rebic was cautioned on two separate occasions, only for Rebic to walk off and continue playing in the game. Why there is no issue, however, it turns out that after a VAR review a Croatia player was indeed show a yellow card by referee Kunate Kakar but it was to Mansukic instead for throwing the ball away. Therefore a repeat of Grampol's fiasco from the 2006 World Cup, when the Croats momentarily benefited from the official failing to spot he booked Josip Simunic three times, was avoided. The first yellow card went to Mandzukic for throwing the ball away, image, AFP, Rebic is shown a yellow card. But it was not his second, image, AFP, should Vita have been allowed to play. The theory, speaking of bans, one player who could have missed the semi-final was defender Domagoj Vita. Following Croatia's penalty shootout win over Russia at the quarterfinal stage, video footage leaked of him alongside former teammate Ognjan Vukovic, who is currently working as a scout for Dynamo Kiev, saying, Glory to Ukraine. This sparked controversy as there were calls for Vita to be banned. Bogoyevich, interestingly, was sacked by Croatia but football made the why there is no issue, FIFA cleared the Croatian to play against England and he went on to produce a dominant display from the second half onwards to keep Harry Kane quiet. Any action that could be taken against Vita will be by Croatian authorities after the tournament. Magoy Vita, subject of £17.5 million bid from Liverpool, Vita made some controversial comments in the build-up to the game, image, YouTube, Vita celebrates making the World Cup final following the game, image, Rex, Shuttershock, was the standard of refereeing up to scratch. A number of England fans were left unimpressed by Q Nate Kakar's handling of the game, in particular how he failed to issue Liverpool defender Dayan Lovren a yellow card throughout the entire 120 minutes. The centre-back struggled up against the pace of Raheem Sterling and was forced to make a number of rash challenges, he even took out Harry Kane on one occasion, yet his name didn't go into the book once. Furthermore, some fans have argued that Perisic's equaliser shouldn't have stood due to a high boot. Referee Kakar had a few big decisions to make during the game, image, AFP, the Turkish official put in a solid performance, image, AFP, why there is no issue, referees have generally had a lenient approach to carding throughout the World Cup, which has been considered by many as the best tournament for officiating in some time. FIFA cannot replay a game based on disagreements of refereeing decisions. Regardless of whether an incorrect call was made or not, the result stands.